The Lebanese national basketball team French, Équipe du Liban de basketball is the basketball team of men representing Lebanon in international competitions. Lebanon has been considered as one of the top teams in the FIBA Asia sector after coming runners-up on three occasions during the 2001 FIBA Asia Championship, the 2005 FIBA Asia Championship and the 2007 FIBA Asia Championship. In 2013, Lebanon was banned by FIBA in all sanctioned events after political interventions in Lebanese basketball. Therefore, Lebanon didn't participate in the 2013 FIBA Asia Championship missing the chance to qualify to the 2014 FIBA Basketball World Cup for the fourth time in a row. The ban was then removed in early 2014 after the election of a new basketball federation. History The first time basketball was played in Lebanon was in the mid-1920s in the American University of Beirut. Gabi Arbaji was the first to prepare a basketball playground in Tabari's area, where the early college competitions were held. In 1939, the first college championship was organized and the finals opposed the Macast team to the AUB and ended with a major victory to Macast with a score of 33–11. The Lebanese Basketball Federation French, Fédération Libanaise de Basketball was jointly founded later in 1949 along with the Lebanese Volleyball Federation. The Lebanese Basketball Federation is a member of the International, Asian, West Asian and Arab Basketball Organizations. The two federations broke up and the first independent Lebanese Basketball Federation was born in 1955. But the Lebanese Basketball Championship was already organized back in 1951. The Lebanese Basketball Championship was organized and the champions were crowned till 1975 when the dramatic war stopped everything. In this period before the war, Riyadi team had the biggest number of trophies. During the war, the basketball never stopped and there were always tournaments organized between the clubs of each section in the country and the players did not stop from doing their best hobby. After the war in 1993 the first championship was organized under the era of Tony Cowrie who stood in the federation for so many years and from that time the media started to have a bigger interest in this game until late 1996 when a new federation was born with Antoine Chartier as a president, at that time the LBC interfered and sponsored the game so this date was the big launching of the Lebanese basketball. The Lebanese made their debut in the European Championship tournaments with Eurobasket 1949, held in Cairo, Egypt. They lost all six of their games in the seven team round robin tournament, finishing in seventh and last place. The refusal of the Soviet Union to host the competition and FIBA Europe's unwillingness to ask Czechoslovakia to host consecutive tournaments meant that 1947 bronze medalist Egypt hosted the competition. Due to travel difficulties and fears, few European teams would travel to the African country to compete. Lebanon, as well as Syria, were asked to compete in the European Championship despite being Asian countries. Lebanon played in the European competition again at Eurobasket 1953 in Moscow. They lost all four of their preliminary round, including one by forfeit as the team refused to play against Israel. The team was able to defeat Sweden in the first classification round, giving them their first Eurobasket win. They placed fourth in their five-team group, advancing to the 13–16 classification games. They lost the first 58–56 to West Germany, but won against Denmark 74–40 to take 15th place of the 17 teams. The two federations broke up and the first independent Lebanese Basketball Federation was founded in 1955. This plan was already organized by the year 1951. The Lebanese Basketball Championship was formed back then, and went into action till Lebanese Civil War. In this period before the war, Sporting al Riyadi Beirut team had the biggest number of trophies. This new federation started to organize lot of championships other categories, ages championships. In 1997 Riyadi finished as Lebanese champions, the next season they went to participate in the Asian Championship they reached the third place and on their return to Beirut the Lebanese fans were on the streets to celebrate this achievement. The same year in 1998 Riyadi lost the Lebanese championship to their big rival Segese. Lebanon hosted a big tournament, the Arab Club Championship which Segese Club won to be the first ever trophy for Lebanon after losing the final in 1996 in Beirut. 
Beirut did not sleep that night all over the country people were on the roads partying till dawn, the next day all the schools were closed as a national holiday. In 1999 Beirut hosted the Asian Championship for clubs, Segese managed to win the first ever Asian title for any Lebanese or Arab team, celebrations were all over the country. This same year Segese managed to retain their title in the Arab Club Championship which was held for the second consecutive time in Beirut. In May 2000, Lebanon once more hosted the Asian Championship for clubs and again Segese Club won it and created history for being the only team to win the championship two consecutive times. Late 1999 new elections were made and a new group came to the federation on their head Mr. Jean Hammam with a big target in his mind to reach to higher levels on the clubs and national teams competitions. So the new federation started to work on the national team's men, women, young men, junior men with bringing the best coaches. After the war in 1993, the first championship was organized under the era of Tony Cowrie who stood in the federation for many years, from that time the media started to have a bigger interest in this game. In late 1996, a new federation was formed with Antoine Chartier as a president, at that time the Lebanese Broadcasting Corporation sponsored the game and is still till nowadays. In late 1999, new elections were made and a new group came to the federation on their head Jean Hammam with a big target in his mind to reach to higher levels on the clubs and national teams competitions. The new federation started to work on the national teams for men, women, junior men. The new group changed the regulation of the federation in a way that can fit the targets designed and they have created new regulations for the players concerning their transfers and their signatures in their clubs. These new rules changed the idea of basketball in Lebanon and the basketball player, he turned down to be a professional one after these changes. The women's team of Segese Club made history by winning the Arab title for the first time in the history of Lebanese women's basketball. In 2000 the Lebanese Basketball Federation signed a contract with Andrew Young. Originally from Birmingham, Alabama, he and his wife and daughter were living in Bahrain. The Lebanese national team won the Waba Championship that year but lost their coach one day before the start of the championship who died in his hotel room due to a heart attack. This event gave the Lebanese national team a bigger motivation to go till the end. The next year in 2001 under another American coach, John Newman, they played the second round of qualifications of Waba which led them to play the Asian Championship for national team in China. This tournament will turn down to be the best result in the history of Lebanese basketball. For the first participation in a such event, Lebanon managed to reach the semi final and to beat Korea and reach the final, and in the same time to reach the World Championship in the USA in 2002. Lebanon lost in the final but in Lebanon every place were full of emotions, and the national team players were the long-time weighted heroes for the Lebanese people, the celebrations were everywhere in the country, the President of the Republic and the Prime Minister met the Lebanese team and congratulate them. In 2002 the Lebanese national team went to many camps in the USA before one month of the championship, and they managed to show a good level of the Lebanese basketball, Lebanon was ranked at the end 16. In 2003 the Lebanese national team with a new coach Ghassan Sarkis reached the final of the Jordan tournament to lose against the Egyptian team, and they reached the semi-final of the Asian Championship in China to lose against the Korean team by overtime and to be ranked fourth overall in the championship. As for the other national teams in 2000 the junior national team played the Asian Championship in Malaysia after playing the qualifications in Beirut in reaching the second place, in 2001 the junior national team won the Waba Championship which qualified him to play the Asian Championship in Kuwait in 2002 in which he reached the ninth place with one loss. In 2003 they played the qualifications for the Asian Championship in Yemen and they reached the second place. The women national team played the Arab Championship in 2000 in Algeria, they won all their games except the one against the home team so they reached the second spot which was a great result for the women basketball. In 2003 they won the Jordan tournament after beating all the Arab national teams with comfortable margin, the women national is full of new generation players. As for the young men national team they played the Waba Championship in 2003 and they reached the second spot. In 2004 Segese made another step in the history after winning back the Asian Championship for clubs in Dubai and to be the first team ever to win it three times. In 2005 the Lebanese men's national team made another historic achievement by qualifying for the second consecutive time to the World Championship by finishing second in the Asian Championship behind China. 
In 2005 Riyadi imposed its supremacy on the Arabic club's scene by winning the Arab Club Championship which was held in Dubai. In 2006 Lebanon had its most successful summer of basketball, the men national team achieved the best results for Lebanon by beating Venezuela and Canada in the ALPOS Cup in Slovenia and by beating again Venezuela and France in the World Championship in Japan. The Lebanese junior national added to this achievement another one which was the qualification to the U19 Men World Championship for the first time ever which will be held in Vancouver, Canada in July 2007. Riyadi, Beirut club once again retained its Arabic title by winning the Arabic title in Morocco. As for the women's Antronic Beirut club created history by being the only Lebanese team to win the Arab Championship for women's clubs for the first time outside Lebanon, the championship was held in Dubai. Stankovic Cup See article, 2010 FIBA Asia Stankovic Cup Lebanon hosted the all-new Stankovic Cup in 2010 from 7 to 15 August. Gazir Club Court welcomed ten national teams from Asia. The tournament was concluded with the victory of the Lebanese basketball team over the Japanese side with 38 points difference and a 7–0 run. FIBA Asia and World Championships In the FIBA Asia Championship, Lebanon finished second three times 2001, 2005 and 2007, losing twice in the final to China and once to Iran, respectively. They participated in the 2006 FIBA World Championship in Japan, the second time they qualified for the tournament first was in 2002. During that tournament, they managed to beat France and Venezuela but lost to Serbia and Montenegro, Nigeria and Argentina in the first round, finishing in fifth place out of the six to be eliminated. The 2006 tournament was considered a success mainly because of the political problems Lebanon was having at the time. Lebanon's 74–73 victory over France was considered one of the upsets of the tournament. Fadi El Khatib was the seventh best scorer in the tournament, averaging 18 points per game. His performances in the World Championship affected his team's status because in Lebanon's victories, El Khatib averaged 32 points per game, while averaging only 10 points per game in Lebanon's losses. Lebanon participated in the 2010 FIBA World Championship and managed to beat Canada 81–71 before losing the remaining of their group games. In the William Jones Cup, Lebanon finished second overall two times, in 2007 and 2010, and third once, in 2009. 2013 FIBA suspension From July 2013, Lebanon served a FIBA-approved indefinite suspension. This came after the parties within the country's National Basketball Federation failed to resolve their differences, forcing FIBA Asia to suspend the country from all of its sanctioned events until further notice in spite of the fact that FIBA Asia Secretary General Hagop Kachirian is Lebanese. However, on 8 May 2014 after recent appeals by the Lebanese Federation, FIBA eventually uplifted the ban allowing the national team to once again compete on the international stage. Topic: Ramifications on the 2013 FIBA Asia Championship campaign. FIBA Asia Championship for Men was the intercontinental championship for basketball organized by FIBA Asia that served as the qualifying tournament for the 2014 FIBA Basketball World Cup in Spain. The tournament was held from August 1 to 11 in Metro Manila, Philippines. Beirut, Lebanon was supposed to host the tournament but the hosting rights was given to the Philippines citing the Syrian civil war and security concerns in the Middle East in general. This is also the last Asian championships that will serve as the qualifying round for the FIBA Basketball World Cup, as a qualifying window will be used starting 2019. Lebanon originally qualified for the tournament after placing second in the 2013 West Asian Basketball Championship. However, after the country's basketball federation was suspended indefinitely by FIBA due to unresolved conflicts within the country's national basketball federation, they were replaced by fourth placer Iraq. But Iraq declined due to lack of preparation, and FIBA Asia instead tapped the United Arab Emirates to replace them. 
However, the United Arab Emirates also declined the invitation for the same reason, and after FIBA's confirmation of the Lebanese Federation's suspension, FIBA Asia decided not to take in any more replacements, reducing the total number of teams to 15. This left Group B with only three teams, and some games were moved from the Ninoy Aquino Stadium to compensate for the lost games involving Lebanon. All Group B teams thus automatically qualify for the second round, regardless of the outcome of their first round matches. Topic: 2015 FIBA Asia Championship Campaign. After winning the West Asian Basketball Championship held in Amman, Jordan from the 29th of May to the 3rd of June 2015, Lebanon qualified to the 2015 FIBA Asia Championship in style after FIBA lifted the ban in 2014, allowing the national team to compete again on the international stages. The tournament was held in China from the 23rd of September to the 3rd of October 2015. In the first round, the draw put Lebanon in Group D alongside Qatar, Kazakhstan, and Chinese Taipei. Lebanon won his first game against Chinese Taipei 92 to 87, then barely lost the second against Qatar 100 to 105 after two overtimes, but managed to win comfortably against Kazakhstan 91 to 55, finishing in second place in the group and advancing to the second round of the competition. On the second round, Lebanon played in the Group F, first against South Korea and lost 71 to 85. After that, Lebanon lost to China 72–90, but managed to win against Jordan 80–76. That win enabled Lebanon to take the fourth position in the group and advance to the quarter-finals, but then Lebanon lost the game against Philippines 72–82 on October 1, 2015. After that, Lebanon played the classification matches and won the fifth eighth place semifinals against Qatar 89 86 on October 2, and qualified to the fifth place game, then won the match against South Korea by a single point 88 87 on October 3, 2015. And with that win, Lebanon managed to finish in the fifth place in the 2015 FIBA Asia Championship after his absence from the 2013 edition. 2016, results World Cup Asian Championship Team Topic: Current roster. Roster for the 2019 FIBA World Cup qualification. Topic: Lebanese NBA players. Rani Saikali, born in Lebanon, represented Lebanon internationally during his playing career with the Miami Heat, especially in the 1999 West Asian Basketball Tournament. Became Lebanon's first ever player to play in the NBA. Matt Frege, represented Lebanon during the 2009 FIBA Asia Championship and the 2010 FIBA World Championship, he was drafted in the 2004 NBA draft by the Miami Heat. Jackson Vroman, represented Lebanon during the 2009 FIBA Asia Championship and the 2010 FIBA World Championship, Vroman was drafted in the 2004 NBA Draft alongside teammate Matt Frege after being selected by the Chicago Bulls. Vroman was later transferred to the Phoenix Suns. Notable players Ahmed Idlibi Jean Abdel Noor, Brian Bishara, retired; Walid Dumiati, retired; Yasser El Hajj, retired; Fadi El Khatib, retired from national team; Matt Frege, retired; Sam Hoskin, retired from national team; Paul Afayaki Kauri, retired; Ali Mahmoud, retired from national team; Eli McIntaff, retired; Eli Rustam. Abdo Chidiak retired. Ronnie Cycli retired. Joe Vogel retired from national team. Ronnie Fahad retired from national team. 
Jackson Vroman retired from national team. Vikan Eskegian retired. Topic: Previous rosters. 1949 Eurobasket finished 7th among 7 teams. 1953 Eurobasket finished 15th among 17 teams. Samed Idlibi, Christos Haji Giorgio, Maurice Nasser, Eli Hamzi, Shauki Rababe, Naim Barakat, Sadadin Atani, Vartkis Alahidoyan, Jean Dyerbakirian, Khalil Mekawi, Georges Estefan, Edouard Karam Coach, on Kadian 2002 World Championship, finished 16th among 16 teams. Fadi El Khatib, Joe Vogel, Roy Samaha, Ghazi El Bustani, Eli McIntaff, C. Paul Afayaki Kauri, Ronnie Fahad, Georges Chibani, Charles Bardawil, Yasser El Hajj, Walid Dumiati, Badr Maki Coach, John Newman 2006 World Championship, finished 18th among 24 teams. Jean Abdel Nur, Hussein Tab, Ali Mahmoud, Rani Fahad, Omar El Turk, Brian Bishara, Roy Samaha, Joe Vogel, Ali Fakhreddin, Saba Kauri, Basim Bala, Fadi El Khatib. C. Coach, Paul Cotter 2010 World Championship, finished 20th among 24 teams. Jean Abdel Nur, Jackson Vroman, Ali Mahmoud, Rani Fahad, Eli Rustam, Eli Stefan, Ali Kanan, Rodrigue Akl, Ali Fakhreddin, Matt Frege, Golub Rida, Fadi El Khatib. Coach, Tab Baldwin.